The human immune system is a highly complex network of trillions of immune cells that protect the body from constant exposure to pathogens and disease. Beta-glucan compounds significantly enhance the immune system to fight a wide range of diseases. In the Peyer's patch, M cells pick up and transport the beta-glucan particles into the body and present them to innate immune cells called phagocytes. The phagocytes transport the beta-glucan to immune organs throughout the body via the lymphatic system. While in the immune organs, the phagocytes digest the beta-glucan into smaller fragments and slowly release soluble glucan molecules over a number of days. These molecules bind to neutrophils, macrophages, and NK cells via the complement receptor, priming them for activity. Activated by beta-glucan, the neutrophils and other immune cells now more quickly navigate to the site of a foreign challenge, a process known as chemotaxis. With the beta-glucan already present, the primed cells need to simply bind to the complement on a bacteria or virus cell to activate the enhanced killing ability of these immune cells. Neutrophils, however, are normally not involved in the fight against cancer because they do not recognize this abnormal human tissue as non-self. When antibodies bind to the cancer cells and attract complement, the primed neutrophils now see them as non-self and begin killing them as if they were yeast. The result is a novel therapy that significantly increases the efficacy of monoclonal antibodies. This combination therapy engages a new arm of the immune system into the battle against cancer.